Welcome back to this clown's garage. In this video, I'll show you how to take a cotter, stubborn cotter pin out that doesn't want to come out. These are original cotter pins in this car. This car is a 92. And all these don't want to come out. So you want to strain it out. You try to pop it. These things bend. And it doesn't want to go through. And you can't grab it on this side with your dikes. So, you could try to put maybe a pin in here, a punch, and try to punch it out. But that's not going to work either here. Well, what you can do is you could just snip it here with the dikes. Then put a punch here and try to punch that out. And if that doesn't work, you can also put an impact gun on top here and these will shear right off. Then you could just use a punch inside to punch it out from the stud. So I'm going to go ahead and punch this out here now. Alright, in this case I couldn't get it to go through over here to, to the other side. So now there's another way of doing this. Like I said, you can use an impact gun on here. It'll shear right off. Once it shears off, you just pop out the rest with your punch. Or if you have you don't have an impact gun, you have to do it the old-fashioned way using uh, two wrenches. So I'm just gonna put your socket on there. Just bang it in. Impact the bitch off. Just like that. Alright, now if you can't impact it off, you just put a wrench here, like I said before, and another wrench here, and use that as leverage to snap that off. Now I'm going to go ahead and punch that cotter pin out. You're going to need one of these small little punches like this. Just put it in the hole and knock it out. Knock it out just like that. And you put a cotter pin in there. As long as you have that hole, you can fit a cotter pin through there. One last issue that, that you might encounter doing a job like this um, is if the nut turns with the stud. Now, let's say over here you have a castellated nut and there's a cotter pin through there that's seized in there. It's frozen in there and it won't come off. And as you turn this nut, this whole stud turns with it. What you do is you got to put pressure on the nut. That's right. In this case, you could put a pry bar under here and push up on it while you're turning this loose simultaneously. You gotta put pressure underneath here and it'll come right off. And one last thing you could do here, instead of using a punch, or if the punch doesn't work, you can always use a little drill bit and drill through here and drill the cotter pin right out. That's another way of taking that cotter pin out. So thanks for watching, subscribe to my channel, you know you want to. Also, Underneath, you can like me, share me, and do whatever the hell you want to me down there. Just playing this clown to go around. See ya!